More sickening and horrifying news, guys and girls, and ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, the people that knew these friends and family, people that didn't know these people, close friends and relatives, are going to be heartbroken again. It's too late now. Two women found dead after being, I don't know if they've been stabbed or shot or whatever, but it's still horrifying and not nice because you see the fingers when you look in the world and you look into people's faces and eyes. That's something you've made in the world. That's something that someone's made. A life. Yeah. Some people don't take it for granted. Someone's brother or sister, mum or dad or daughter, that's life's been taken. Let's watch a bit more GBD and see what's been going on. I'm going to cross to Nottingham now, where the bodies of two women found in a property in the area were believed to have been undiscovered for some time. That's according to Nottinghamshire Police. Yes, they were called to a property at around 11am yesterday after concerns were raised for the welfare of the occupants in the property. Um, shall we cross over to Nottingham for an update with GB News East Midlands reporter Will Hollis? Uh, Will, uh, tell us the detail. Yes, well, police were called to Hartley Road here in Radford, which is a suburb of Nottingham City, at around 11 o'clock yesterday, after local residents raised the concern for the welfare of the occupants living in the home behind me. Now, when they were inside, they did find the bodies of two women. Local people, neighbours say that the people living here are a mother and a daughter and the police say that while there is no immediate risk to the public they are keeping an open mind as to what happened in the property now this of course is concerning for local people in this part of the east midlands and i was speaking to one man alan greaves about what uh, one man tony greaves who's well, recently moved to the area there. from birmingham and he was describing well there's nothing wrong with that but the thing is these two there's just too many two deaths all the time here. And yes, people are probably getting sick of it. It's really shocked me. I've just come out on the Wednesday market doing what I've got to do. You know what I mean? And then find out the two women have lost their lives. And, it, yeah, it's, of course it's upsetting. I'd, it's like I wouldn't want, you know, if you've seen some kid getting knocked out in the street, you wouldn't want that. You don't want it from your area. area. Now, everyone's going to be on alert now. And all these people are just sitting back. Oh, we've done this check. We didn't do that check. But they've left it too late. People are dying. Always seems...